Is this really it? It seems like a dead end. You'd think that, but the old text say something a little different. Check this out. Looks like a perfectly ordinary stone, but if we turn it just like this... Was something supposed to happen? Hold on, just give it a sec. Oh, 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 here we go. We got another train. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the train episode. No more Whoa, there should be a dragon shrine in here. Let's go. All right, whether there's a save point or not, I'm going to call it an episode. So, oh, maybe not. Maybe this is just... I thought this would be like an area we had to go into, and I sense something peculiar over there. I believe it is a world dragon soul, but it looks like it's guarded. Guess we can't just walk it up and take it. Well then, we'll just have to do it the hard way. Okay, I thought this would be like a enormous area, but it's not. Um, Alright, let's dragon it up. And, oh crap, that's not what I wanted to do. Can I... Song. Let's do the song. The world resonates in my heart. I call upon the rhythm of nature. Dragon. Okay, we'll power. watch the dragon animation this time. It's been a little while. All right, let's dance, homie. Just eat it. Just eat the damage. Oh, you're broke. That's that's the ripping chat. That's the ripping pepperoni. I almost feel as if I'm over leveled for this. We only have 500 experience for that. What is that? 500? He was level like 29. I believe that was the only monster present. Let us free the dragon soul and take our leave. Hang on, I found some kind of inscription. Wow. And it's in glyphs. This stuff is ancient. Okay, what do we got here? Hmm, looks like a monument to Ragnarok. I'm a little rusty, but the text reads something like, The Great War saw dragons pitted against Deus and its faithful Draco Machina. At last, dragonkind triumphed, and Deus was sealed. But victory came at a heavy cost. Warrior dragons fell in battle by the score, leaving crystalline souls behind. A world dragon's soul herein lies, the airy king and lord of skies. I see, but who wrote it? The high elves who allied with the dragons, I presume. After the war, they must have brought the Sky Dragon's soul here, in hope that it might finally rest in peace. When you put it like that, it seems like a real shame to disturb it. But I guess we don't have much of a choice. Indeed. We cannot allow it to fall into the Empire's hands. I feel bad for the Sky Dragon, but we'd better take it with us. Yeah, here, Lady Kirika. Put the dragon soul in this. Is that... Yep. This magic vial can preserve souls. It's basically the same thing as the one Beatrice had. Understood. Now. O oh soul draconic, pure as the firmament, though this vessel is but unworthy, I beseech thee to accept it. That's it. The dragon's soul is safe in here. Wow. So that's how you do it. Hmm? Guys, we got company. My, this is a pickle, isn't it? They've taken the world dragon soul. Well, take that. Hand it over now. Joachim, at... Sorry, but that's not happening. Oh my gosh, how many trains are going to go? They're not even, like, close. They're just loud. 
You won't relinquish it? Of course not. We'll never give it to you. Mmm, I suppose this is a blessing in disguise. Now I can test the adjustments I made to the magic oculum. The what? A hip... A hypo... What? Am, I can't read. A hypothesize that the... I hi, Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I hypothesized... For some reason, I don't know. That the oculum malfunctioned due to the due to interference from the shining dragon. It's time to see if my countermeasures worked. Now, et, crush them with your upgraded oculum and bring me that world dragon soul. Et, please stop this. I don't want to fight you. Then give us the dragon sword, or I'll beat you down and take it myself. What do you et, see? come here. I can't actually be a dragon right now, so he's got a chance. I will break you at though. Come here, kid. Let me break him. What is happening? Oh my gosh, I'm confused. What is happening? I'm not. I'm. Oh, what is going on, dude? What is he- what is he- okay good, we're deep, we're, we're not messed up anymore. Come here, Et, you little pansy, get back here. Et, what are you doing? Come here. Hey, leave Kiriko alone, she's the only thing that keeps us all alive. Et! Come here! Had enough of this, Et. Yeah, get broken. Et! Hmm, I suppose my countermeasures against the Shining Dragon wasn't enough. Wow, I got... I got time taken off of my... Of my break. Oh, well, he's broken now. Can we fill that stupid bar to max so that I can... Alright, let's change the... Oh, can I not change the song? I can't change the song. My heart is well, Et, just get absolutely mauled in the corner. Good night, buddy. Alright, I'll take the 1500 EXP. That's nice. Give me that. Et. Et, but I... I'm Marion. What? No, I'm Ed, not Marion. Ed never died. I. Uh... What on oh, earth? Dear. Well, this is problematic. Ed. I. 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 Ed, pay attention when I'm speaking to you, Ed. Now, what do you say? Huh? Uh, oh, sorry, Joachim. The Shining Dragon had more of an impact on the identity equilibrium than I expected. This calls for further testing. That's enough, Joachim! Stop torturing Et! Well, well, well. Hand them over, or else. Or else, what? Please, enlighten me. Take a guess, Big Shot. Maybe you can figure it out for yourself. No, oh, I'm shaking in my boots. But I'm afraid my masterpiece doesn't belong in the hands of simpletons. Then I guess we'll have to do this the hard way. Hey, is the Shining Dragon here? Huh? This guy bring a friend? 
Aha! Your timing is impeccable, Zest. Truly impeccable. Zest? Damn it! Him? Zest? Who's that? He's a knight of the Empire, and they say he's completely nuts. A killing machine. He's never happy unless he's fighting. He might just be the strongest the Empire's got. This could get ugly. <laughs> you are well informed. I suppose the Astorian soldiers must have been telling horror stories about him. Oh, and Zest. That's him. That boy is the Shining Dragon. And they have the soul of the Sky Dragon. If you'd be so kind as to fix that. Come, Et. Our work here is done. Right. Et! Come on. This kid is the Shining Dragon? I expected pathetic, but this? Oh, well. He's got three dragon ears with him. Maybe I can still have some fun with this. Oh, good. We get to fight Zest. Hey, home slice. Come back here. I don't even think I can break him. I mean, it's not even acting like I can break him. Man. We're getting absolutely destroyed. This is what I bought all of this crap for one day. Um, what's up this? Temporary? Uh, okay, don't need that. Alright, get back up. Take a potion. Take two potions, you take a potion, I'll take another potion. We're using all our potions, but how much mo- I have a lot of money, we're good. Um, give me that. Alright. Alright, we gotta bring him out. Well, come here. I will wail on you in this corner, bro. I gotta keep an eye on the health in the bottom. Okay, so now we gotta play our song. If we just have to keep fighting enemies here, I might have, I might have to split this episode into two. Oh, you got broken, but I'm on a stamina. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't pause. Oh god. Can I not? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Everything, calm down. I need to give a potion to. Oh, she healed herself, so now I got to potion us all because she doesn't have any MP, and I got a mana potion her. Please, game, game, fine. Let me MP myself again. What's mana missed? Oh, for the entire party. No, we'll just use it on myself for now. <clears throat> can I not? Can I not drag it? There we go. Hold on. Oh, gosh. Sonya's going down again. Oh, she got healed. Can we break him again, please? Oh, there's the break. Oh, crap. Oh, we don't have enough. Oh, crap. It's, it, it's all it's all going downhill. Attack Zest! Oh, gosh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, Sonya. We've all... It's all gone very badly, very, very quickly. Alright, 
Alright, uh, Kirika, I'm gonna need a heal. I can't die. Heal me, Kirika. Okay, we got him. That was really dicey, really quickly. Another 1,500 experience. We just got, like, 3,800 experience there. Damn, he's good. I see. So this is the Shining Dragon and his merry band of Dragoneers. Not as bad as I thought, but I'm falling asleep here. This isn't fun. It's just annoying. Uh, this is turning into a real hassle. Don't underestimate us. You may be strong, but we've got you cornered. This battle is ours. Battle? Wait, 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 hold on. You think I'm seriously fighting you guys right now? That was just me saying hi. Huh, you talk a pretty big game for someone who's losing. <laughs> Come on, are you serious? Do you just not get it? Okay, sure. You guys want a real fight? I'll give you a real fight. Come on, you just had to open your mouth. Come on. Oh, we're not beating him this time. It's not, it's not happening. Can we... Okay, thank you. Can we not? And one for you? I'll take you all! What's the matter with you? You said you wanted a fight, so I give you one, and you can't even keep up. I don't know why I even bothered. I knew this was going to happen, but you got my hopes up. And now you gotta pay the price, Mr. Shining Dragon. You're supposed to be the strongest of the world dragons. What a load of shit. You have any idea how annoying this is? Hey, come on, how many? You can tell me. Pick any number you want. <laughs> How many pieces do you want to be sliced into? <laughs> Come on! How many? Stop! Whoa there. No matter what, I won't let you kill my friends! Wow. Not a lot of people get back up after a hit from me. I gotta hand it to you. But now, you're pissing me off. Why'd you stand up, huh? You trying to skip the line? You want to be the first to die? If you want it so bad, then sure, I can make that happen. Come on! <laughs> Fine. I'll save the Shining Dragon for last. You get to die first, and the rest of your friends. <laughs> Sonia's in danger. Everyone's in danger. When we fought Genus, I couldn't do anything. I was so scared. I didn't have the courage. You are. You guys already figured this out at this point, but this episode is getting split in half. Just, just an FYI. This time, I'm going to fight. I have to save Sonia. Can I like absorb that dragon. stupid, that stupid uh, uh other world dragon soul? Oh my gosh. Grant me more. More than ever before! I've never, you know, wanted to have my window open and it had so much stuff going on outside my window. Now someone is mowing. Like, come on. What the? Oh, you're pissing me off. Stay out of my way! <laughs> Well, that's interesting. A little more feisty now, huh? What? Saw your friends in trouble and decided to fight for real? Kind of. <sighs> Come on. This sucks. You can't bring out your power for your own sake. If all your strength depends on someone else, then you're weak. You know, your life isn't gonna mean anything if you stick around with a bunch of weaklings, right? 
Guess that's all you're worth. You and your pathetic little crew deserve each other. Uh, talk about a letdown. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm not even feeling this anymore. Killing guys like you isn't even worth the effort. Nothing personal, but you just aren't that interesting. <laughs> Later. Guess we got lucky this time. Thank you, Yuma. If it wasn't for you, we'd be dead. Yuma? What? <gasps> Sonia! Are you okay? No. He's losing control of the dragon's power. What? What happens if he lets go? If he unleashes the Shining Dragon's full power, it would be enough to annihilate the shrine. Maybe the entire region. No! Yuma, listen to me. Get a grip, man. You're gonna hurt someone. All you gotta do, you guys just gotta get your instruments going and and he'll be good. That's what I've learned from playing this game. You can, you can calm a dragon with a song. This isn't working. Kirika, how do I help him? You guys gotta play your instruments I together. Him. If he lost control, I promised I'd stop him. Just tell me what I have to do. Calm yourself, Agnum. I am a diva magica. It is my sacred duty to commune with the Shining Dragon. Allow me to reach out to him. His mind seethes, but I can calm him. See the scaleless? Right. Sorry. I'm counting on you, Kirika. Make some vi other video Kirika game references. Can you hear my voice? Zest is gone. The threat has passed. Please be at ease. No one here means you harm. So please. <sighs> Play your song, guys. That's how you calm the berserk really? dragon. Are you all right? Yes, I'm fine. Your radiance, I beg of you, please open your heart. He's not listening. Stay back, it's too dangerous. No. But I'm a diva magica. Why can't I? Kirika, let me try talking to him. Oh yeah, we got a connection. We had the we've had the worst flirting connection through whatever ten episodes of this or whatever. You, but but how? Even my lady couldn't do it, and she's a diva magica. I know, but I have to try. <sighs> Yuma, are you in there? It's me, Sonia. Wow, that was such a fantastic attempt to <sighs> do absolutely nothing. Sonia, someone play their music. It's okay. Play. Your music. Hey, Yuma. You remember me, right? It's Sonia. Just calm down and look at me. Yeah, I'm here. It's okay. Can you listen to me for a little bit? Zest is gone now. You saved everyone. Thank you, Yuma. But please, you have to calm down now. You're gonna hurt someone like this. This isn't you. You wouldn't hurt the people you just fought to protect. You wouldn't let that happen. No, it's more than that. When you come back to your senses and realize what you've done, you'll hurt yourself most of all. I don't want that to happen. So please, Yuma, calm down. You have to come back to your senses. Yuma! Huh? Sounds, Sounds like, like someone's, someone's calling me. Who is that? Yuma. Yuma. Sonia. Sonia's calling for me. Yeah, okay. Everything's okay now. Huh? Something about this feels 
so familiar, but I can't remember why. But something about Sonia's voice makes me feel so calm. Yeah, I can just... Yuma! Looks like he's at least transformed back. Come on, we need to get him back to town. Resounding voice, Sonia's trait. Please, not like an hour of dialogue now, please. Yo, back in the land of the living? Agnum, you're looking a lot better now. Less scales and teeth, too. Oh, right. I tried to use the Shining Dragon's power, and then... Right, I... Sonia. Is Sonia all right? Oh, you do remember, huh? Look, don't worry about it. We know that wasn't your fault. She's pretty tough, you know. Well, we've got her resting in her room right now just to be on the safe side. <sighs> hey, come on, look at me. I told you, you don't have to worry about it. But I'm the one who hurt her. I knew I couldn't control it, and I still tried to use more power than I could handle. I've... I've always been scared this would happen, and still... I just thought it would be okay this time. I thought I could handle it. But I wasn't thinking rationally. I mean, it's kind of my fault too, right? I promised I'd get you back to your senses, but when it came down to it, I was pretty useless. So all I can do is apologize. Honestly, man, I'm really sorry. Agnum. You have nothing to apologize for. But hey, all things considered, I think that proved your training's paying off. Huh? Think about it. You lost control, but it didn't go as bad as it could have, right? We're all still alive. You kept yourself from unleashing the dragon's full power. So your training's definitely helping. But Sonia was the one who... Sonia helped you out. That's fine, man. She's your friend, and it's okay to rely on your friends. If it's still too tough to control all on your own, then we're gonna be there to help you out. You can count on us. But you keep using that power, and trust me, it's gonna get easier and easier to control. So don't worry if you can't handle it alone yet. You're gonna get better, but until then, we're here for you. But... Not sold yet? Okay. Let's say you screw up again, and we get another taste of freaky dragon Yuma. This time, we'll all stop you. What? We just proved it's possible to get through to you. So next time, it won't just be Sonya. We'll all be there. Everyone would. Yep, everyone. So remember, no matter how bad things get, we've got your back. Sound good? I guess, but that means next time, I might hurt all of you. Hey, don't think like that. We learn from our mistakes. Have a little faith. I mean, uh, you might end up chewing on us for a bit. But we've been training too. You can't eat us that easy. Lucky for you, because, uh, we probably taste terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Agnum. I guess I'll try just believing in everyone. Eh, don't worry about it. <laughs> you really do think too much, man. But yeah, uh, might be a good idea to check up on the girls. Specifically, the girl who risked her life for you. I'm no expert, but, uh, she probably deserves at least a fist bump. Huh? Oh, right. You think Sonia's awake yet? Probably. You gotta go say hi. Right. Thanks, Agnum.
Is Sonia here? Ow! Huh? Ow! 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 Emma, can't you be a little more gentle? Oh, listen to you gripe and complain. A real knight would scoff at this kind of thing, you know. Why, my uncle? You can't compare me to Captain Burroughs. He's built totally different. Ah! Ow! <laughs> it's my it's fault my she's in all that pain. pain. I have, I have to, to apologize, apologize to her. To her. Oh, if it isn't Yuma. Yuma, what a relief. I'm glad you're looking better already. We were all so worried when you collapsed. Huh. Thanks. Did you want to talk to the princess about something? I'm just about done here, so if it's all right with her... Of course. <laughs> then I'll be downstairs. Thanks, Emma. So, you want to come in? What's wrong, Yuma? Something on your mind? I won't take up too much of your time. I just... Wanted to a Sonia, I am really truly sorry. It's because of me that you're hurting. Huh? Uh, hey, Yuma, it's really okay. You don't have to apologize. If you hadn't called on the Shining Dragon, we'd all be finished. I can't believe I let that guy beat me up like that. Ugh, I'm getting mad just thinking about it. The point is, you don't need to be upset, okay? <sighs> Look, Yuma, you can't let something like this bother you, all right? Huh? The Shining Dragon stuff, I mean. You don't need to beat yourself up because you lost control once or twice. Nothing ever goes exactly according to plan, right? Especially with that kind of power. You still minimize the damage and you suppressed it in the end. That's pretty amazing on its own, I think. I know you'll be able to control the power of the Shining Dragon. I believe in you. <clears throat> Besides, Yuma, even if this happens again, we'll just stop you. I promise. So don't worry so much. <laughs> What's up? Sorry, it's just funny. Agnum said pretty much the same thing. He told me to take my time getting used to the power, and that you'd all stop me if I lost control again. <laughs> Figures. I guess we're all thinking the same thing. I'm thinking this game is... <laughs> really, really a story-based game. Right? Hearing that from both of you makes me feel a lot better, though. I feel like half of these episodes are dialogue. Like, I, I really actually enjoy the combat of this game. It's kind of repetitive, but I actually really enjoy it. And I enjoy fighting and whatnot. But man, it's been like... 15 minutes of dialogue. I, I just, it's it's just almost too much. It's why I can only play this game in, in moderation, like one or two, like an hour a day is enough. And I feel a little more confident now that I know everyone's watching out for me. I'm going to work hard, Sonya. I swear I'll find a way to control the Shining Dragon's power. Also, if I could just, you know, kick back in my chair and listen to the dialogue and it would auto go, that would be fantastic. But I have to sit here and I have to click yeah. A. And I'll be with you every step of the way. And sometimes I click A too early and then it just annoys me. I think I'm starting to see. Perhaps this is why Sonya succeeded where I failed. I always presumed the Shining Dragon and Yuma were one and the same. But if I was wrong... Yuma, I was so sure I knew what you are. Perhaps it's time I learned who you are. Oh look, it's Genus. This must be it. Hmm. Its power still lingers. The dragon must have been on the verge of complete madness. No sign of damage though. 
No matter how powerful that boy's keepsake, he could never suppress the full power of the Shining Dragon. Hmm. But that leaves only one possibility. That boy suppressed the Shining Dragon on his own. Hmm. I didn't think him capable of that. Does the boy possess some power beyond my understanding? Hmm. Yuma, was it? Perhaps he's the one. Perhaps he'll lead me to the truth. Okay, so is that the end of... Yeah, that's the end of Opus 3. I believe there's eight Opuses, if I, uh... If I remember correctly, I believe there's eight Opuses. So, I'm actually... I shouldn't have saved it there. I'm gonna call it an episode here. We'll start Golden Sonata in the next episode. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you all then. Peace out!